Hey guys, welcome back to Tony's Outtoos. In this video, I'll be showing you how to create multi-page Canva website. Before we start, hurry up and check out our latest software just under this video. So let's get started. Now you might be wondering, how do you create a multi-page Canva website? Now in this case, creating a multi-page Canva website in Canva can be kind of difficult because we are only limited to one page here and whenever you try something or whenever you try adding a new page it's just going to add a specific length on that website website in this case i actually have this uh, web page or website i actually prepared for you in this case whenever you publish your website here typically you're just going to see this one and whenever you click on add page here it's not going to necessarily add a new page for your canva website it's just going to add the a length to your website so you can just basically add text uh you could add images on it advertising your web business or your website here now in this case you might be wondering how do you actually create your own uh, multi-page canva website here well typically it's kind of complicated here like uh, what i mentioned before because uh, right now that functionality does not exist in canva but there are going to be some workarounds we could actually try here to imitate another way of actually having a multi-page canva website now just to give you an example i'm going to actually make this as my main website here so typically you just need to create your website click on publish website here and as you can see we have different categories that we could basically start clicking here now in this case how do we actually add another page for this one well instead of creating another page here because again like what we uh, did before whenever you click on add page here it's just going to add length well, for us to actually add another or a different page for our website here, we need to create another website or web page on Canva itself. Now, typically, you can just go home here, just go to your search bar here, just type in website, and you should be able to see different templates that you could use. So, for example, I want to use a specific one that is related to my website. So, maybe I want to say I want to add headphones here. Let's go ahead and add headphones. Once you added that, you should be able to see the options here. So maybe I want to use this one. So let's go click on it. Now from here, let's go and click on customize this template. And from here, what we need to do is just basically start editing our website. So you could change your images here, events, change the text or whatever here. So by the way, if you're not familiar how to start using Canva here, we actually have a tons of tutorial regarding Canva. So you could visit our channel and see a bit of tutorials on how to change images change text and a lot more but in this case uh, since we want to start adding a new web page for our original web page here we now want to uh, go ahead and publish that let's go ahead and click on publish at the top right here and for canva or free accounts in canva we actually have the capabilities of adding like for example publishing five website urls now meaning you could have at max five pages that you could actually use for your original website in this case let's go and click on publish website here you could do any customization you could do you want here but for now we're, we're just going to publish this one now in this case we just need to wait for it and from here you could just click on view website or just click on copy now, just to give you an example, I'm going to open up the open this up in a new tab here just to make sure that make sure that you actually view it. But once you've done that, let's go ahead and close this one. And from here, let's go ahead and go back into our original project, which is our original website. Now, what we need to do is we need to choose the appropriate icon here that we want to link to. Now, the only problem here is you cannot actually add links into specific groups here or specific elements on your canva project but a great thing about this one is whenever you click on a specific text here just to give you an idea i'm going to actually remove uh this specific link here to make it in, in the original format here so in this case whenever you click on a text here you actually have the capabilities of adding links so whenever you right click on it you should see the link option here which is Control k if you're going to add it in your shortcuts in this case once you click on it you could just basically paste the link that you want to uh, redirect this to so in this case i'm going to actually uh paste my link here and from here let's go ahead and click on done as you can see it now has that underlying effect here now once you've done that let's go and click on publish at the top right here to make sure that our changes is actually uh made let's go and click on republish website and once it's actually published or republished, we should be able now to actually view the other page that we just did. Just in case, let's go click on view website. And from here, whenever you click on the headset option or text here, it's going to redirect us to another page. 
Now, in this case, this is not a T-Rex solution that you're looking for, but in this case, this is the only thing that we could do right now for Canva. Now, it's a great idea to uh, basically name your project accordingly. Like for example, if you have multiple projects here, like for example, make this, uh, name this project here as a main website, and from here, you want to name this as product website and whatnot. Now, in this case, a great organization here can help you a lot to make sure you organize your projects here accordingly. Now, in this case, this is a workaround that we can do right now in Canva since they do not support it yet as of this moment. So, yeah, so that's about it. So, if you found this video helpful, hit the like and subscribe button and watch our next video.